I'm really like. <laughs> What is going on? It is your girl Candy, and as you can tell, it is going to be a different video than normal. I'm pretty excited to do this. <laughs> um, side note, I did not record this eye look. I just did it, and I'm kind of mad at myself that I didn't. But if you would like a tutorial on this bad boy, let me know down below. Um, if you are part of my candy fam, um, thank you so much guys for coming back and rocking with your girl. Hey, rocking with me, rocking with me, rocking with me. <laughs> Thanks for coming back you guys and if you're new, welcome. I hope you enjoy this video. Um, today's video is no way near sponsored. I just wanted a wig and the type of wig that I wanted was kind of like an afro-y, um, something where I can like make it different but like not so yeah <laughs> if you like to see how I style this wig what kind of wig this is blah, 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 <laughs> then go ahead and stay tuned as you can tell I am going to be opening the whole package with you guys we're going to be trimming it and styling it yada 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 let's jump into it um, as you get the package, the package is from Amazon. It did get here within like two, three days of me purchasing it, just like typical Amazon. Um, per the instructions on the bag, it does say to go ahead and take out the wig. Give it a good shake so that the curls can go ahead and relax and kind of fall down so you can see how it places on you. And I just wanted to show you how thick and curly this fro really is going to be. The curls are really coiled and it was really lightweight. It's not heavy whatsoever. I purchased the Asahi hair. This is their synthetic afro curly hair wig. This is a 14 inch wig. It is black, which is a 1B. Um, with the cap, it does come with an adjustable straps as well as two combs to ensure that the cap is really nice and snug. It is heat resistant. I can definitely say with me having no hair and me using a ball cap, I really didn't need it, but it did provide a more secure section for the wig, I guess if you want to say. And when I put on the wig, it did fit me pretty loose, but once I adjusted the straps to fit my head and made sure that it didn't fold over my ears, it actually was a really like tight snug, but not too tight where I'm like, okay, my brain can't breathe. But it was really like I can move it and shake it and it did nothing. So how I learned being around a cosmetologist is that if you have curls, you really don't want to tease them automatically unless you want that crazy type of after effect. If you really want to keep the curls in, you want to tug from underneath, like near the root and then down to the, um, the edges of the, the hair. So you want to pull the hair from the back and like pull it back um, with your fingers spread out. Um, to me, that is the best way to still ensure that the curls are in, but it also helps drop it and it also kind of like gets it um, shaping framely right for your face. Once I have it the shape that I kind of want, I'm going to go ahead and start trimming off the hair. I'm using just a regular pair of scissors. Um, when you are cutting hair with curls, you want to curl or you want to cut the curls in a downward position rather than straight forward or any other direction other than downwards. The reason why you're going downwards is that it's going to help ensure the actual curl stays in place and it, it makes sure that there's no extra hair falling out that you get all over your chest or throughout the day. It just kind of ensures that the curl stays in. So now that I have the shape uh, to one side, we're not going to go ahead and match it to the other. And then we're just going to go ahead and play with it, make sure that it matches what I want. And if it doesn't, then we're going to go back and fix it because it's a wig, you can fix it. It's, you know, that's what it's there for. Um, yeah, that's the end of the tutorial, guys. Again, I really wanted my wig to be really thick and very curly so that's why I didn't really take out a lot of the curls um, you definitely can wash this wig it definitely does come with instructions on how to wash it um, how to take care of the wig and yeah this is gonna be the end of the tour super short super simple I really like this $15 wig you can't go wrong with a $15 wig that you can cut style make a fro straighten it do whatever you want to do and still look a popping baby so 
yeah, let's just, um, let me stop rambling and get to that damn video. Well guys, um, sponsor, this is my first wig that I ever like really just purchased on my own and I styled it on my own. I kind of researched a little bit about how to take care of the wig. As I said in the, um, in the audio, it did come with instructions, but you know, you kind of want to know a little bit more plus it's a curly wig and curl wigs you want to do a little bit different than straight wigs like instead of like you doing this you want to do this to pull out the curls because you're tugging from the root and dragging out the curls rather than teasing it and then you get this like frizz stuff and so just learning different things i think i really like it i'm not this is not too bad for a 15 dollar wig okay and it got here fast and it came with a wig cat and it took me less than 30 minutes to cut and style, so that's not too bad. I mean, it could be a lot worse, you know what I'm saying? Like, it could be a lot worse. So. If you guys like this way, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more reviews of this or me just playing with different stuff, let me know. I just really appreciate you guys so much. If you're new to the fam, thank you so much for joining. I appreciate your love and support. Um, if you want, please check me out in my other platforms. I have my website. I have the Instagram where I do a lot of engagement on there with you guys. And I'm also on Twitter, but I need to be really, I need to be better at that. I keep saying it, but. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna end this video because you know how I do. Can you lie? Let's just talk for no reason. Hey. Anyway, again, see, I do this, I do this, I do this. <laughs> Alright, guys, I'll check you at the next one. I love you, and um, thanks for stopping by. I'm really happy right now. Hey. I don't think I, I've been doing neutral stuff on Instagram, it's just really boring. <laughs> like, I like neutral palettes. But I just love color, man. Seriously, this color out, I should have really filmed this. I'm sorry.